Kevin and Nile will walk to this other side and then the rest of the people will walk with Helen. Helen, have your location. I'll be doing cardiac ICU. And I'm Brandon Hayes, 30 year cardiology fellow from Cincinnati. Uh, Jim Rager from Cincinnati and uh, Bob Williams, cardiac ICU from Vanderbilt. I'm Mary Taylor, cardiac ICU from Jackson, Mississippi. Go Broncos! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Rebecca Nesbitt, cardiac nurse from Vanderbilt. I'm Don Moore, pediatric cardiologist from Vanderbilt, though I did train at Cincinnati. Yeah. This <laughs> is the true mix. <laughs> I'm Reed Quinn and I work for Bob Groom. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm Russ Sway and I work for Arnetta. Five days later, American Airlines lost it in Dallas, and it has arrived safely to Tenwick. Once thanks, it was lost, but now it is found. All thanks to Gladys and her persistence. Yes. Lord, with all my heart, I worship you. Brandon Hayes from Cincinnati, Ohio. We bring this gift so you can keep serving us the wonderful, amazing food that you prepare for us every day. We are so thankful. May this be a blessing to you. Thank you so much. Yeah, have a good day. Oh, wonderful. Lord, I give you my heart. I give you my soul. And I'm named in honor of Edna Bora because she delivered me as a premature baby in 1952. Yeah, it's Wednesday of week two, and uh, as predicted, people are a little tired, as we usually see. And we've had some very challenging cases. Uh, two cases yesterday that were difficult trusting the Lord to bring healing to these uh, patients, but we're still strong and looking forward to the rest of the week. Sweet pictures. Um, Dr. Moore here is taking a look at our patient's heart and assessing how her new mitral valve is doing and a little fluid around the heart and helping the ICU team manage her best. I'm just here doing a uh, post op echo checking for an effusion on this patient with our new tiny portable echo machine, uh, which we're all actually very impressed about the imaging. It's not a lot, it's just kind of a thing. We're just doing a little bedside scan, checking for a pericardial effusion and making sure her heart's squeezing okay. Looks like it's squeezing pretty good. Well, this is Peter and this is Kelvin, and they both had surgery last week and they're doing so good and you're up and walking and talking 
and praising the Lord. Are you all happy? Ah, we're so glad that they're doing so good. Amen. God bless you guys. This is Peter, and Peter has been a blessing to us here at Tenwick. He comes from Nairobi, That's right. and he finds children that need money. I have uh, Barbara, yeah. who is the president of a non-profit organization, Take Heart Association Project Inc. And she is the, my, my queen, because she really needs quite a, a lot of money. In this case, I was trying to ask her, uh, what shall we do about this, this case of uh, Tenwick? And immediately she raised over $20,000. And I was very happy because I was able to save so many children here in Tenwick Hospital. Amen. That is really a miracle. With the child's heart Go face the worry of the day with a child's heart turn each problem into play no need to worry no need to fear just being alive makes, makes it all, it all so very so clear Ooh -ooh. with the child's heart nothing can ever get you down Ooh. with a child No. Mm -hmm.